What is up you guys, it's Bolty98 and in this video we are actually getting in gameplay looks at Modern Warfare 3. It has the Uzi, it has high ride rails, let's get straight into the video. Guys, I don't want to wait no longer to show you this. We have all 16 maps coming to Modern Warfare 3 right here. Guys, make sure you hit that sub button. It literally takes two seconds and it means a lot to the channel. 87.8% .8 of you guys are not subscribed, so make sure we change that today. If you decide not to sub today, please let me know down below some feedback so I can change your mind next time you're on the channel. Anyways, let's get straight into what you came here at the maps. High Rise is the first map we're going to be showing. This map looks spectacular. You can see that they took pictures from the High Rise rails where we'll be able to like get up there and do trick shots we also got scrapyard which looks awesome as well you know they are really incorporating the new engine and how everything can look on these next gen consoles versus the old time if you guys want to watch the video where you can see all these where they show you i will have a link down in the description here's derail and then we of course got invasion i'm definitely curious on what you guys think is your favorite one favela to me is probably my favorite one so far that they've like mention like the way it looks and how much in input that they had to put into it really shows how well they did estate is another good one that looks just awesome but they all look super cool so i'd definitely be down to you know hear your favorite one down below or if you have multiple let me know we also see overpass and karachi of course all 16 modern warfare 2 2009 maps came into this game as our base maps Rust even being one of those maps is back and it doesn't look the exact same from the Modern Warfare 2019 version So they must have changed it a bit. Here's Afghan where it looks awesome like the the detail that they put in this You can actually see I don't know if you guys had the issue when you would go back into old the old cod It was like everything had like a color tint to it Like if you played Afghan you, everything was yellow if you played Skidro everything was like greenish if you played sub base it all be kind of bluish that is something that they said that they really worked hard on not having any more since gameplay and game engines have grown so much they were allowed to be more creative but also allow more detail in their maps here is in-game footage of modern warfare pushed very hard to make sure that that experience was as close to the original as we possibly could while we modernized the look of them wow guys from this we can tell a couple things well a few things that i could tell number one being it looks that we are going to be able to do those trick shot spots that made high rise so spectacular back in the day with getting on the you know the rails and stuff like that and jumping from rail to rail as you can clearly see the gun that he's carrying is the mini uzi from modern warfare 2 2009 but that is confirming that it is going to be in modern warfare 3 we also have this image here where you can jump from the middle of the map or on the sides into the middle of the map just by you know mantling up here's the in-game footage at favela where we see a shotgun being held and we kind of see that a coney operator is going to be in modern warfare 3 he may even be our modern warfare 2 battle pass again or he comes out in a Modern Warfare 3 season. Either way, it's super refreshing to finally see some type of content on Modern Warfare 3 from the developers again. We've had that mission, but that was about it for a minute. So to finally get more content in the form of multiplayer maps and all 16 base map images right there, I am super excited, super pumped for Modern Warfare 3 to come out. Hopefully you guys seen a bit of the gameplay and some images and stuff makes you more excited also because it pumps me up, honestly. It really does. I'm so excited to get in there and play the Modern Warfare 2 2009 maps on the new engine. But guys, that's going to be the end of this video. Please leave your favorite down below, favorite map or favorite thing that we mentioned in this video. Or if there was anything that you think won't work, let me know down below because I'm interested to talk. I love talking in my comments, so just let me know anything down below. I'll see you in the next one. Please hit that sub button, like the video, and share if you thought it was worth it. I'll see you in the next. Peace.